Hello children, I hope you all are fit and fine. I am Ramita Anchan and I welcome you all to your English lesson. Today I am going to teach you a poem, The Raindrops. The poet is not known, we don't know who the poet is. So let's, let's start. I am going to recite it and then I will sing it for you, okay? When I sing it for you, I want you all to sing along with me, yes? So let me recite it first. The raindrops. Pitter patter raindrops falling from the sky. Here is my umbrella to keep me safe and dry. When the rain is over and the sun begins to glow, Little flowers start to bud and grow and grow and grow. Now, let me sing it for you children. The raindrops. Pitter patter raindrops falling from the sky. Here is my umbrella to keep me safe and dry. When the rain is over, the sun begins to glow. Little flowers start to bud and grow and grow and grow. Now children, you can sing along with me. The raindrops. Pitter patter raindrops falling from the sky. Here is my umbrella to keep me safe and dry. When the rain is over, the sun begins to glow. Little flowers start to bud and grow and grow and grow. So children, you must have learned to sing it now. Now let's go to the explanation part. I'm going to explain it for you. The raindrops. What are raindrops children? Raindrops are the drops of rain that fall from the sky. Let's go to the first stanza. Pitter patter raindrops falling from the sky. What is pitter patter children? When the raindrops fall on the ground they make the sound pitter patter. You must have heard the pitter patter sound when the raindrops fall on the windowsill or on the window pane or you must have heard it when you are in the ground floor. Yes, you must have heard that sound. Pitter patter. Here is my umbrella to keep me safe and dry. So children, here she's got an umbrella. Why? To keep her safe and dry, to protect her from the rain. So, what color umbrella she is carrying? She is carrying a red color umbrella. How about me? What color was my umbrella? That was yellow color. So, children, she is carrying an umbrella to keep her safe. And how about you? What do you like to carry or you wear? You wear a raincoat so that you can protect yourself from getting wet in the rain. Now, let's go to the meanings here. Raindrops, they are the drops of rain. Pitter patter, that is the sound of the raindrops when it falls on the ground. Now, let's repeat the stanza again. Pitter patter, raindrops falling from the sky. Here is my umbrella to keep me safe and dry. Now, let's go to the next stanza children. When the rain is over and the sun begins to glow. When the rain is over, over here means the rain has stopped. What do you see at that time children? You see the sun begins to shine. So glow here means the sun is shining. So when the rain stops, the sun begins to shine. Sometimes at that time you see a beautiful rainbow. Have you ever seen a rainbow? You must have seen it, right? So here, 
do you know the colors let me tell you there are seven colors in a rainbow they are red orange yellow green blue indigo and violet you know all the other colors but violet it's a shade of purple and indigo it's a mix of purple and blue now let's continue little flowers start to bud and grow and grow and grow so children what is a bud bud it is a small part of a plant that grows or that develops into a beautiful flower you must have seen a bud in your garden isn't that yes so what happens the bud they grow into a beautiful flower now let's go to the meanings now over means stop glow means shine bud a small part of a plant that develops into a flower let's repeat the sense again when the rain is over and the sun begins to glow little flowers start to bud and grow and grow and grow let's do the meanings again rain drops that that means drops of rain pitter patter it's sound of the rain drops when it falls on the ground over means stop glow means shine and bud a small part of a plant that develops into a flower homework you have to do some homework children and there the first one will be you have to learn to recite the poem number 2 you have to prepare a paper umbrella you can take a picture of your umbrella and you can send it to me number 3 will be draw a rainy day or draw a colorful and beautiful rainbow that is upon you you can do anything or if you want to do both that is up to you yes i hope you have understood and enjoyed the poem thank you stay home stay safe